United Kingdom are getting a whopper of an admission from Burger King, the fast food giant admitting the presence of horse meat. Come two years after horse meat was found being passed off as beef. The United States was found to contain horse meat, confirming a frightening suspicion horse meat is in our food supply. There is so much that goes on with the food system that people just don't know about. I think a lot of it is intentional. There was discovered that what was expected to be other kinds of meat, like beef, was actually horse meat. The horse slaughter industry is really a racket, a trafficking racket, if you will. The people who are profiting on horse slaughter are those who are engaged in overbreeding of horses. And this is an issue that isn't over the radar, it's under the radar. These horses uh, have been doped with all kinds of uh, concoctions. The idea that that same horse then would be sold off and put into a food supply creates a tremendous concern on my part. The most common drug administered to any kind of horse would be butte. The butte issue is extremely serious. It causes kidney failure, it causes adrenal problems, it also in some cases can affect the marrow and bone. Butte can be destructive at extremely, extremely low levels, way below detectability. That is why on drugs used for horses, on the label says, not for human consumption. The European public is not aware that much of the horse meat that they consume, either knowingly or unknowingly, comes from North American horses. About total 20% of all horse meat consumed in Europe is from North America. Most of that comes from U.S. horses that are shipped to either Canada or Mexico. The public needs to understand that there are forces that want to reinstate horse slaughter. There are some members of Congress who are very beholden to the agriculture industry and have been sent a clear message that the ag industry wants horse slaughter to resume. I didn't write the laws. I, I am trying to do a legal business to make a living. I don't want to hear that it's just business. I mean, everything's about business, everything's about money, but you have to draw the line.